Repairs made in under two weeks to Cow Creek Bridge and Hurricane have left many residents in the Polka area upset. They say they've dealt with an impassable bridge for years and can't seem to get their voices heard. 13 News reporter Haley Kosick is with us, has more and is with us. Haley? Alex Cow Creek Bridge has had their fair share of issues. In fact, many bridges in Putnam area have seen better days, but for this one bridge near Polka, shut down for three years. The taxpayer side of residents living near it feeling forgotten, angry, and upset with elected officials who promised it would be fixed long ago. A little country church opening their doors once again for Sunday service. Putnam County families gather, offering their thanks to the Lord on his day. It starts my week out right being here with you all, and and, and, and I just like to praise the Lord and, 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 and all of you all. I'm glad to be here. Glad to go. Nothing stopping them from worshiping their God, but the inability to cross Lanham Road, a serious Sunday setback. Well, it used to be that you could be at our church in less than 10 minutes that way. Now, since the bridge is out, <laughs> you can go maybe, what, 20 yards, and then you're going to turn around and have to go 35 minutes that way on these roads to get to our church. It's, it's a hassle. It's really a, it's, it's, it's hard to get back and forth. For three years, the state and county unable to follow through with their promises time and time again. So I, I don't know. I, we've been waiting on, they, we keep saying, they keep telling us. As Lanham Bridge left to crumble away. Instead of taking five minutes to get to church, these people take up to 30 minutes to drive around. Thankfully, they still do because they're faithful people, you know, thankfully. But there's people who live across the river, said if we didn't have to drive all the way around, they would come to our church. Locals urging officials to build a new bridge and get over the holdup, because for them, their time for God, precious. 13 News will stay on the story as new details arrive, but for right now, the bridge looks to not get fixed anytime soon, but residents plan to continue pressing the Department of Highways and local representatives to get it fixed. Helico 13 News, working for you.